What's good? It's Shigozi. It's Thursday, January 6, 2022. And in the news, the you know, the news, which is just Jesuit order rituals, the Columbus Zoo has sacrificed another one of their animals by the numbers. And we've seen them routinely do this from that one gorilla to this. I mean, they've sacrificed so many animals. And this is, to me, another dog star ritual, dog star 42, dying on a day with 42 numerology. And before we continue, cheetah, I don't I don't even know what the fuck this is. Cheetah ambassador dog. I don't know if it's a, I decided to look it up. It, I don't know if it's a breed. It didn't show anything about it being a breed of dog. But a cheetah ambassador dog equals 110 like Columbus. And it equals 79 like murder. Right? Murder 79. Columbus 110. Columbus 110, murder 79. And that's what cheetah ambassador dog is. You know, I know it's a, it's, it's a male dog, but, you know, bitch does equal 42. But they're just telling it it's a male dog. I mean, I don't know. And before I forget... They updated this at 536, Buckeye equals 36, as they always do. And they're telling you about this today on 1 slash 6. Ohio equals 16. Always doing these numbers, these rituals by these numbers. Ohio 16 on 1 slash 6. They wait to tell you the death of this dog, which equals 61 in Jewish. Because God equals 61. God and dog have the same gematria, right? So dog equals 61 in the Jewish cipher. And they went to six slash one to tell you this by the numbers. Again, your local news is by the Jesuits. It is concocted by this numerical language of Gematria. Published at 331. Blood sacrifice equals 67. 331 to 67 prime. Again, I'll show you for new. Blood sacrifice in the most pure cipher 67. B is the second letter. I is the 12. 1 plus 2 is 3. O is the 15. 1 plus 5 is 6. And so on. 67 when you... Sum each letter to single digit in Adam. You see that? 331 is the 67 prime. So at 331, they updated this. Human, I know it's not a human, but human sacrifice also equals 67. But this is a blood sacrifice for sure. If, if he even died. I mean, they could have just given him to you know, some person, some Jesuit or something. Hey, you keep this dog out of the spotlight, which is extremely easy to do. I mean, you, you could even fool me. I mean, if I saw this dog walking in the street, how the fuck would I know it was him or not? So, I mean, this dog could easily be alive. I don't think he is. I think they sacrificed him because they love doing this type of shit. They say Kobe had chronic arthritis of his neck and secondary spinal cord compression. You know, neck equals 33. So... It doesn't end there. Kobe was born on June 22nd, 2013. So you first see what type of, what day of the year that was, what birth numerology he had. 22nd of June, 2013. And I have noticed a lot of 13s. He died 33,113 days from when he was born. And that's even 1331, Saturn, Dog Star, you know, Saturn 42, serious type of riddle. But no, look, he's born there with 61, 16 numerology. Ohio, Ohio equals 61 and 16. Dog equals 16. Or excuse me, dog equals 61. Again, how, how are these not clear riddles? Ohio equals 61 and 16. 22 plus 6 plus 20 plus 13 is 61. 2 plus 2 plus 6 plus 2 plus 0 plus 1 plus 3 equals 16. And in Gamatria, see, so this is why I, I try to show you. They, they see this. This is, this is not Gamatria right here. This is not Gamatria. This is date numerology, right? So it's a different facet of this Kabbalah, right? So do you see how they pair? They pair this date numerology with with now the Gamatria. See, this is what they do. They, they, they pair them. And that's how you know for a fact that they're doing this shit by the numbers. Ohio now, when you reverse the alphabetical order, where A is 26, Z is 1, Ohio 61, and in doing that reduction that we showed earlier, you know, O is a 12th letter, 1 plus 2 is 3, H is 19, 1 plus 9 is 10, 1 plus 0 is 1. You reduce each letter to a single digit, you get 16. I mean, how is this not clear? And this is a dog from Ohio, at least, or at least maybe he wasn't born in Ohio. I mean, who knows? Yeah, he arrived at the zoo, he arrived at the zoo as a puppy. So he could have been born anywhere, but still, he, you know, this is an Ohio riddle. His property, unfortunately, of the state of Ohio is very clear. This is an Ohio dog. Being used by the numbers, sacrificed by the numbers. You know, government 52, death 52, 52 second video. And they'll play you know, some emotional music to get you to cry. Guys, I'm sure this made some people cry. It's just so sad that these people do this shit.
See? Some acoustic guitar. Shows them when you're cuddling with other animals. Gotta bring in the piano. This is emotional manipulation. Do not fall for this shit. See? So he helped raise cheetahs, BB and Zemba. That's why he's a cheetah ambassador. Okay. I'm gonna watch this then. This music is just so, I mean, it sounds good, but that's what's pathetic about it. It's called emotional manipulation. I mean, it's just so sad. Like, imagine your dog dies and you listen to that type of song. It's just going to completely fuck with your emotions. So, we can see the name of the cheetahs he was with. But before I forget, I want to show you how many days from his birthday he died. He died 191 days from his birthday, like Society of Jesus 191. Society of Jesus equals 191. They are the ones who did this riddle. Killing equals 43. And 191 is the 43rd prime. See this? These are riddles from the Jesuit order, from the Society of Jesus. And then for the kicker, well, really the kicker is the 191, but you know the Buckeye pattern. What does Buckeye equal? And we see this every single, we see, guys, we see this every fucking riddle these people do. Buckeye equals 72, 27, and 36. So they update this ritual at 536 the 36 man of the hour and then this dog dies 27 weeks and two days from his birthday 272 like 2772 they do this every single time saturn 69 you know six months nine days from his birthday again i know dog stars 42 but is it also 69 no it's just 42 though 84 the jesuit Again, this guy, again, Columbus Zoo and Aquarium, these are the people, right? These are the people who had their appeal, their accreditation accreditation appeal denied two months, seven days from when they requested it. It was on, it was on a Wednesday. They said, hey, we're going to request our appeal to be, you know, from, from being removed for accreditation. And two months, seven days later, the board of zoos said, no, we're denying you. It's obviously a ritual. The Jesuits were in both organizations. Just like how, just like how what? Tom Hanks gave a speech at Rice State University two months, seven days from his birthday. They do this two months, seven day shit all the time. Don't forget the governor of Ohio, Mike DeWine, his birthday was yesterday, born January 5th, 1947. They were 27, 72, numerology, 36 days remaining, Ohio equals 47, Columbus 47, that's the 15th prime number, born 1 slash 5 and 47. His birthday alone should let you know that this is a numerical practice. Mike DeWine equals 53. Again, I, again, guys, why would I want to, why would I want a governor that's this coded? It's not me talking up my state or being proud uh, of this. No, this is bullshit. I want to leave this goddamn country. But it's, I just really think my governor has one of the best, most coded birthdays in the entire study. I mean, it's, it's my opinion, but I mean, it's just so perfect. Ohio, 47, born in 47. The capital's Columbus, right, where he supposedly works out of. 47, that's the 15 prime, born 1 slash 5 in 47. Buckeye equals 27, 72, 36. Born a day with 72, 27 numerology. And 360 days remaining. And I have, a, I, have a, I have a video on this channel showing you how he'll probably win governorship just ba pretty much based on his birth numerology. The guy's just an agent by the numbers. The guy's literally a plant. The, 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 Richard Cordray, him, it was all scripted. That's John Richard Kasich against Richard Cordray. And then we had, what's his name? Richard, what's his name? Oh my God, that fucker. Excuse me, I meant to say Mike Richard, Michael Richard DeWine versus Richard Cordray, and then you have John Richard Kasich, right? John Kasich, the other Ohio governor. Richard 61. That's why they call him Richard 47 like Ohio. I've shown these examples too many times. This state alone proves this is exactly what's going on. The Jesuit order, again, Je Society of Jesus 187, the Ohio State University, Founded in 1870. It's right there on their fucking seal. 1870. Like Ohio also equals 187. So yeah, that's really it. Kobe Cheetah. His name was Kobe. I, I did his name Gamatria. Maybe I gotta do it again. I, you know, nothing. Sure, like 45. The sum of Saturday by the Squares. What the fuck? God damn. Or above playing in it. Shut up.
I'm sick of these. I, just, I hate their autoplay shit. It's so annoying. Kobe, 18, like Sun. Columbus, Ohio, 63. Judge Lord, 63. The Summer Saturday's Magic Square, 45. Ritual, 45. I do see a lot of, you know, getting Dog Star stuff in this. But yeah, again, no point making this longer. You see the riddle here. I kind of do want to do arthritis. That's what he had. Fifth is satanic. Blood sacrifice one two one and sixty seven. See, blood sacrifice one two one and sixty seven. Satanic one two two fifty. This is a satanic blood sacrifice. Satanic also equals sixty seven. A satanic blood sacrifice, which is exactly what it is. One hundred percent what it is. This is a satanic gang of Jesuits. Doing these sick rituals by the numbers. And they even mentioned the Ohio State University here. At, you know, that's where you got treated at. This, again, this is this is an advertisement for, for Ohio State. You gotta understand, this is how they advertise their services in these sick rituals. And I'm sure he was probably put down, at, they probably sacrificed him at OSU. They probably killed him there. Maybe not. I don't know. But I know he was killed by the gang. For a fact, if he if he died, either, either he faked his death or he was sacrificed by the Jesuits. He probably didn't even have you guys. He probably didn't even have arthritis. That's what's sick about this. He's probably a perfectly healthy dog, killed by the numbers. I know cheetah, I know cheetah, sex kitten symbolism. All that. There's even more with the cheetahs here. Look at the cheetahs' names before I forget that, and then we can close this video because they mentioned the names of the cheetahs in the video, but they also named them here. But let's let's just go to the video so I don't have to dig around for this shit. And you can hear the shitty ass music again. Look at this. It's just emotional crap. Uh, like, like it's so pathetic. Like, who are they trying to fool with this crap? Yeah, this is why country music has everyone killing themselves. It's, it's like country, man. It's like country music is so depressing. Oh, she, 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 she took my tractor. You know, in the annulment, I couldn't get. I didn't do sign the prenup. She took my tractor, and I'm gonna kill myself. Uh huh. Gotta play my John Deere. Gotta play my guitar. Gotta blah blah blah. Like, it's just that type of music. And you know, not, no, nothing against any of those things. You know, I like guitar too, but still, this is BB Zemba. Okay, BB and Zemba. BB 86, like blood sacrifice. Again, they're, they're part of this ritual. I don't care if they died yet or anything. There's this is the death connected to them. And Zemba, <laughs> of course, Zemba with the 47. Ohio 47, Columbus 47, Ohio 47, 25, and it has 88 counties. And these are all time numbers time 47, 20. 25 and then 88 connects to time with the analemma, the sun, the moon, and back to the future. They go 88 miles per hour. Time and Ohio have the same gematria, even in the satanic cipher, that 187 I was telling you about. Again, these riddles are so obvious. When Ohio does riddles, it is the same fucking pattern they do all the time. It's the same pattern. It's the same pattern every time. That's what I'm trying to show you. It's the same fucking thing. That's why you can't see the state and be like, oh, they don't practice. Like, you no, know, you're retarded if you say that. They fucking do all the time. You see the sun. They're sealed the sun as well. They love the sun. Buckeye's sun. Same numbers. 27. The Ohio State University. A university run by the Jesuit order. 1870. Society of Jesus 187. Ohio 187. Time 187. This is, an, I call it an unofficial Jesuit school. It's not officially listed as a Jesuit school, but it's run by the Jesuits just as much as Georgetown and Gonzaga. Even Georgetown's not really, right? Georgetown's Catholic church, but if you go to Georgetown, if I recall correctly, they don't, they don't technically call it a Jesuit school. But that's when they, 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 this technology shit, fuck it. You know it's a Jesuit fucking school. You know it fucking run by the Jesuits. There's no doubt about it. But, but see, they call it Catholic. See, Roman Catholic. Well, they do. I swear to God, though. Yeah, I swear when they're talking about it here, they were they didn't like for example Gonzaga will tell you right away. So yeah, it was founded in Jesuit tradition, that's what I'm saying. But they didn't really say it like outright. But again, don't let it fool you, so I'm trying to say guys, this is definitely Jesuit school. I'm not saying it's not, I'm just saying how they how they write it out in Wikipedia. That's all I'm all I'm talking about. Versus maybe you know, Gonzaga, this fucking school. With their fake ass basketball, fake ass rig sports. Well, I don't want all this. Well, guys, you can do research on all these are all Jesuit connected shit. Oh, maybe they don't do. Oh, well, guys, see, found it. Okay, I'm just talking my ass. But guys, I, guys, I, I, the last thing I want to do is confuse you. And if I've confused, you, I'm sorry. I'm just showing you how Wikipedia lists out these things. That's all I'm doing. This is a Jesuit school. These are Jesuit schools. Georgetown, Gonzaga. Georgetown, guys. I was Georgetown is a Jesuit school. Don't let me say it's not or, or convince you it's not. No, it is. I'm just, again. I'm just. I was talking about how they. Kind of, you know, don't really say it out front in this paragraph. 
Not that they have to. Not that they have to. Again, not that they fucking have to. Not that they have to. See it? Not that they have to. I don't care if this has no religious affiliation. It's run by the Jesuit order. Christina M. Johnson is one of their actors, one of their agents. This is an agent long neck. Look at this fucking. She belongs. I mean, just, just think about it. This agent makes you want to do a lot of things. You know, you're doing some yard work, chopping down some trees. It's like, hmm. Test this thing out somewhere else. All right. So I'm going to leave it there. Peace out. Fuck Georgetown. It is a Jesuit university run by the gang. Found from John Carroll. Let me show you one other Jesuit connection. I, got, I think after just that, I got to show you some more examples with Georgetown. I just feel a little bit better. Georgetown University. Jesuit Georgetown, where these Jesuit agents went to. And guys, what I'm really trying, my point is don't let Wikipedia, don't let these people fool you into thinking that these are not Jesuit run institutions. That's my entire point. But, you know, John Carroll, this is a Jesuit, another agent for the Catholic Church. You know, don't let these people fool you to letting you think that all oh, the Jesuits aren't doing much anymore. No, they're doing everything. John Carroll, 54, like Jesuit order. John Carroll, 63, like Jesuit order. I also like his name equals 511 in the Satanic Cypher, like Saturn. But with the S exception, it's 63 as well. This is a Jesuit agent, a Jesuit coadjutor, a Jesuit doing things by the numbers. These are the people who run America. They've been in America before the feds have. Washington, D.C., which equals 187, was Roman to Potomac. The Catholic colony is not even part, technically not even part of America. It's its own city, independent city state. Baltimore equals 50, like Freemasonry, which they, people founded. So yeah, I can, I can go all day talking about these people, so I'm going to close it before this video gets too long. Again, Jesuit equals 42. Like what? Like what? What do you think it equals 42? Like, like Georgetown, 42. It is a Jesuit institution run by them. They were pretty clear with it, but again, I, I think it could be founded in Jesuit tradition, but now, you know, they don't really, that's what they want you to think. It's founded in Jesuit tradition, but and it's like, no, fuck out of here. You know, again, they're fooling you retards with this shit. So I'm saying they're fooling some dumb, oh, the Jesuits don't really run Georgetown. They went to Georgetown. It was nothing much Jesuit. Nah, 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 nah. Some dumbass will say some stupid shit like that. I'm telling you, they're dumb. They're not, don't listen to them. So you guys to tell you this type of shit. See, that's, this is why I was even talking. See, the Jesuits have participated in the university's academic life, both as scholars and administrators, since 1805. However, the university has always been governed independently of the church, and the majority of Georgetown students are not Catholic. See, this is the line I read. This is why I even brought the whole thing up. This. So, you know, I'm not talking my ass. I'm just going off what Wikipedia is lying to you about. <laughs> They're lying to you. You're saying that this is governed independently from the church? Guys, the Ohio State University is not even governed independently from the church. So why would you believe some nonsense from Wikipedia saying that, that Georgetown is governed? How would the fuck would you believe that when you have a public school, which again, since it's public, it's run by the federal government, which means it's run by the Jesuits, it's run by the state of Ohio. See, public, it's literally from the, the federal government. So you can't, if you're denying this is Jesuit, you're retarded. So again, let me stop ranting. And again, we've been there many times. Once it's warm again, we'll go back here on my bike. Once it's warm again, see, you know, see the campus again, see this fucking diaper, diaper cladded retards walking around thinking that they know it all. You know, the you know, physical activity center, the sports, this is bullshit. This is bullshit. This is a waste of money. That's all it is, a giant waste of money. Look at this. I mean, look at this Coliseum. <laughs> Remember we were here, we had Fox, Fox Sports was out here setting up the shit to, to deceive more people. They play fake football here anyone who comes here yelling thinking this the games are real watching the, they're retarded this is the little bowl for retards that's all it is it's like you have a big, big cereal bowl the milk is all the jizz from the jesuits all their jizz is the milk and all the fucking little piece of cereal the dumb motherfuckers who fall for this emotional ass bullshit oh the dog just died oh ha, ha. it's like crying this fucking guitar music this is pathetic all right peace out peace out see you in the next one